Hello, everyone. Um, yeah, I'll be showing how to, uh, you know, how to make a wood splinter effect with, um, with Apex Destruction because, let me show you, see? It's like splinters there. Now, you normally wouldn't be able to do that with Apex Destruction by itself. So, if we look over here, got all these little wood splinters, right? A flash of the mesh, it looks like stone or something. Now, if you head over to blend or any, um, thing, with, uh, something that can, like, do wood splinter effects. Let's just undo all this. Go to object, um, quick effects, cell fracture, and on the scale, if you, like, a low number, I guess, uh, you know, and then one, make sure it's like upwards like that, and then make sure you applied it, so, apply all, right, control A, effect cell fracture, and X, Y has to be one by one, Z has to be point on one, hit OK, wait for it to do that, remove the original cube by continuously clicking on it until <coughs> you've got all this. Get okay, file export FBX. And then you wanna put it anywhere you want, you know. And then point to wood or something. Make sure that you can find it. Export FBX. And then over here you wanna import your FBX chunks. Now make sure Ah now make sure that your mesh here um, is straight up and down, or the rotation that you have this at, and then you create a destructible mesh. You go in here, mess with all these parameters, whatever the heck you want. You know, there's a whole other tutorial on all these parameters, lots, but they never really show you this. But, to make sure to enable this, you have to go over to, uh, you have to go over to edit, plugins, Search up Apex Destruction and built in, and Apex Destruction has to be enabled. Import FBX chunks, splintered wood. Might know some scaling or something. You don't know exactly. Doesn't matter. You can scale it back any way you want. You can place these in your level. Um, I want to make sure that's not a leak at the beginning so it doesn't splinter immediately. And then test this out with something that will trigger it. Simulate physics. Oh. Yeah, we're not in the exact spot. Yeah, there we go really adds a whole lot of depth to this. That's just part of the door, but, uh, yeah. That's it. Well, I'll see you next time, I guess. Uh, bye.